Welcome to the Ross Steiner Gallery on the GCC campus. I'm Shirley Verico, the new director, and I'm here to give you a virtual tour of Quinceañera, our recent display, which will be up until November 7th. Quinceañera is an exhibition that features two artists, Yolanda Daliz and Anita Welich, and they are Latino women who have been collaborating for 15 years, and they are celebrating that 15 years of collaboration with, this, with small groups of artwork to represent their major projects, and they're all here in one large exhibition in the gallery. Their first collaborative op, um, effort were these wooden books, and they chose the book because it was a symbol of the power of the word, and we look to books as an absolute. And if you look at the books, you can see that each wooden page is two-sided, and each artist did one side, and then they bound the books together with these wooden pegs. Many of the books include text and found imagery, and they come together to serve as an icon or a symbol of the complexity or the duality of feminine identity, both as women in the 21st century, but also for these women as both Latino and American. After working together on the wooden books, Yolanda and uh, Anita expanded the project and created La Casa. This is a large installation work of over a hundred different panels. Again, the wood panels are worked on two sides, Yolanda doing one side and Anita doing the other. They then wove the panels together into this metaphorical house, representing again this idea of the center of identity, the center of home. And the exhibition allows you to actually enter the house and move through it, looking at both sides, and encourages you to do that. This is the wall of women, and we see here a variety of sculptures by each of the artists. In this case, they didn't work together on any single piece, but rather hung their individual pieces grouped together. And this was part of an exhibit called Mi Casa Tu Casa, My House is Your House, that was exhibited at the Kirkman Art Center in Kirk Clinton, New York. This is an example of the various kinds of women that our artists experienced that they knew or that they knew of, and they wanted to create a large exhibition showing this diversity of identity, both cultural and independent. We have an installation also called Momage, Momage, it's an homage to the mothers. Mothers are everywhere, and the artists chose a symbol to try and capture the sort of ubiquitous and oftentimes um, ignored quality of mothers. They looked to uh, a metaphor of the pillow as an object that is in our household, it's in our home, that can make us comfortable, but is often overlooked. Sometimes it's merely decorative, sometimes it's useful. And both artists created pillows based on phrases or sayings that were contributed by various uh, viewers of past exhibitions where they took quotes about uh, strangers' mothers. And they took these quotes and created metaphorical representations in the form of the pillows. They then placed these pillows within a bedroom context of both the crib and the bed to further emphasize this relationship between mother and child. Nuestra Historia, our story, was created especially for the Ross Steiner Gallery. It utilizes our projection system and allowed the artists to project both examples of their artwork and their own history through photographs and video onto the specially created wall display. They chose fragments of fabrics recalling kitchens and bedrooms, the sacred places of mothers, and these fabrics allow for the images to be distorted and broken up, sort of softening the edges again, relating back to this idea of a fragmented identity. The latest collaboration effort by these artists is called Mother Nature, and it's a series of digital prints, all of which were created, in fact, just printed out for, especially for this show. This collaboration allows them not only to work together side by side, like they did in the wooden books or in La Casa, here they work actually on top of one another's work, sharing the work virtually through email, and adding to or removing images, layering images until one of them deems the project finished. This is a truly collaborative effort where there is no clear delineation between the work of one artist and the next. Uh, I think this artwork here uh, shows the trust that these two women have developed over 15 years of collaboration and really speaks to the relationship between Yolanda and Anita.